Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get started. In this video you will see in which direction the price of Ethereum has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators SMA, EMA, Divergence and Stochastic RSI are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the hourly time frame for Ethereum, the price rapidly went down with around 16.1% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 1885. We can see that the sellers are taking over because the volume was high, showing that this move was strong. Jumping to the hourly simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is below all of the simple moving averages, which looks bearish and you should keep an eye on the closest SMA, the 20 SMA will play as resistance or the price will peak above the current price which is around 1993. However, the shorter time frames are not very accurate and the bigger time intervals like the daily should also be considered for longer price development. Jumping to the hourly exponential moving averages, the price at the moment is is situated below the hourly ribbon, which is usually bearish and the ribbon can act as a resistance, so you should keep an eye on if the price will break it or bounce of it. The current price to watch is around 2086. The ribbon is spread out so the resistance should be strong. On the lookout for divergences in the hourly time frame, there was a bullish divergence, but the price went to the downside, which was actually not expected. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time, but the percent %K line is below the percent %D line, which means the current trend is on the downside. Jumping to the three hourly simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is below all of the simple moving averages, which looks bearish and you should keep an eye on the closest SMA, the 20 SMA will play as resistance or the price will peak above the current price which is around 2137. However, the shorter time frames are not very accurate and the bigger time intervals like the daily should also be considered for longer price development. Jumping to the 3 hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is below the 3 hourly ribbon, which is generally bearish and the ribbon could play as a resistance, so it is to watch if the price will bounce off it or break it. The current price to watch is around 2,241. The ribbon is spread out so the resistance should be strong. Searching for divergence in the 3 hourly time frame, following the bullish divergence, the price went up and quickly came back down. Looking at the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, we can see that the crypto is being oversold because the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region. A change in the trend can be expected or for the crypto to remain at least stable for some time. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so it should be waited to see if the trend will actually change to the upside. Moving to the daily simple moving averages, the current price is between the 200 and the 100 SMA. If the price bounces off the 200 SMA which is currently at 1865 it could be seen as a support and the 100 SMA that is at 2499 could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. Pointedly, the current price is above the 200 SMA, which is perceived as a strong support. Nevertheless, if there were to be a decisive downward dip, it will signal a possible big move down. Moving to the daily exponential moving averages, the current price is below the daily ribbon, which is generally bearish and the ribbon could play as a resistance, so it is to watch if the price will bounce off it or break it. The current price to watch is around 2,568. Nevertheless, a trend change can be expected owing to the ribbon being compressed, which means that the trend is currently not very strong. Jumping to the daily stochastic RSI, we can see that the crypto is being oversold because the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region. A change in the trend can be expected or for the crypto to remain at least stable for some time. The K line is currently above the D line, which shows that the trend has shifted to the upside. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out.
If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.